Hey guys and welcome to the Buy and View. Hopefully you guys are all doing well. In this particular video, I'm going to be talking about Eden Hazard apparently being offered to Bayern Munich uh, and Manchester United and probably various other clubs. Um, let me know what you think, uh, but obviously I'll read, this, I'll read the story, give you my opinion. You can let me know what you think in the comment section down below. That's the whole point of this channel, you know. It's a community channel. It's your channel as well as my channel. The Buy and View, the Buy and Munich fan channel um, that we're, we're building here. So hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Smash the thumbs up if you're going to enjoy the video. Like I said, let me know what you think. And let's get into this. Right, so this has been, uh, this was put out this morning at nine nine uh seven minutes past nine in the morning um at the time of recording this right now it's coming up two o'clock in the afternoon i'm not really too sure when this is going to go out uh but this is what it's saying so it said real madrid attacker eden hazard offered to manchester united and bayern munich uh, real madrid attacker eden hazard has been offered to manchester united um uh, ESPN say United are one of the four clubs to have rejected the chance to sign Hazard um, as his struggles, as he struggled at Real Madrid. Um, uh, Eden Hazard, um, 30, I don't know why they always do that. I understand that he is 30, but they always, do, whatever, um, has struggled to reach his heights that uh, convinced the Spanish giants to splash out um, 89 million two years ago with the performance based. Uh, and certainly he's taken that figure to around 150 million um, pounds. Wow, that's actually got pounds on it. I thought that was going to be a euro sign, but it's actually pounds. Mad. Uh, however, uh, injuries um, have derailed the former Chelsea star's progress in Madrid, where he has scored just five goals in 53 appearances in all competitions at Los Blancos, which is obviously Real Madrid. Uh, United have become the latest club to snub uh, a move for the winger with Bayern Munich, PSG and even Newcastle deciding against taking a gamble on the former Chelsea star. Now, what do I think about this? Would I take Eden Hazard if it was on a free 110%? If it was on a free, of course. He, you know, yes, he's 30, but, you know, the levels that he was reaching um, at Chelsea at the end of his Chelsea tenure and Chelsea career, if you want to say, um were very, very, he was definitely top 10 in Ballon d'Or, you know, that year. And if he wasn't, he should have been. Uh, so I would take him. Um, the, the only thing is he's got that big money move uh, and it's just gone. I don't know if that's because of um, the shirt number. Could have been the pressure of the shirt number. It's the number seven. I don't know. Maybe I'm just, I don't know. Um, or maybe because Real Madrid just don't have the players... Or the manager. Well, then again, they had Zeredin Zidane. I can't even say that they didn't have the manager, you know. I don't know. I don't know what's happened to him. But when he was over in Ligue 1, very, very good player. Obviously, come over to Chelsea. Could have joined Manchester United, I believe. Uh, as well as some other clubs. Uh, and absolutely ripped the league up. Absolutely ripped it up. Uh, and, um, you know, it's crazy. It's crazy that Chelsea did the business that they did. Because they, I believe he had one year left on his contract, and they got eighty nine million pounds for him. That went up to uh, with perform uh, with performance base um, things in there that took that figure to about one hundred fifty million pounds, which is stupid money. You know, it, generally that's like that's not even. I'd say that's probably what Harland would go for now. You know. Um, which he probably was worth it then, but then obviously just flopped. So, would I take him? Yes. Um, but I'm not really... Then again, he's probably on massive wages. I'm not sure. I, for the for the talent that he is, 100%, I think he is a brilliant footballer. Uh, and could he re-spark that in the Bundesliga with Bayern Munich? Maybe. Um, so I'd definitely take him. Obviously, there's been things before, you know, James Rodriguez, we had him on loan when he wasn't in favour at Real Madrid and he did OK for us. You know, James Rodriguez, James Rodriguez, or whatever you want to call him. Same thing with Coutinho. So maybe maybe we'll see a loan move. Maybe maybe there'll be a loan in there. He is only he is 30. I'm not really too sure. It doesn't say in this particular article and particular uh, thing about his contract. So I don't know how many years he's got left or whatever. But um, one thing that has to be said is, um, you know, would you take him on loan one hundred and ten percent? You know, even if we had to pay half the wages, more than half, whatever. I think he's, I think he's a cracking player. Generally, I do. You know, and with the links of obviously Coman leaving, um, yes, we got Miss Lara playing, re ready to play there. Um, but 
we, we do need to get another winger for me personally. You know, Sane can play right and left. Gnabry can probably play right, left and, and in the middle. Um, and then obviously, when I say middle, I mean number 10, by the way, not striker. Uh, and um, obviously, Koeman can play left and right also. So I do feel like we do need to get a winger. I know Misler is there. I know he's he's performing, putting in performances and he'll, still, he'll keep on getting minutes, which he obviously deserves. Cracking player. And I think he's going to be one of the best players in the world um, in the next whatever, how many years. Um, but would I take Eden Hazard? Most definitely. But only on loan uh, or on a free. I wouldn't be wanting to spend ridiculous money on him. I don't know what... It, the, in this particular article that I'm saying, they paid £89 million for him. They went up to £150 million. Um, And the thing with it is I'm not really too sure what they want to sell him for. Because they even fifty million, I don't know. Like he's thirty. What's that? He's probably going to go to his thirty-four. That's four years. Is he going to get back to that top flight? You know, when you when you start getting older, unless you're Ronaldo or Messi, you know, you do start to dip. So I'm not sure. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Would you take Eden Hazard at Bayern Munich? And uh, with that said, uh, that's going to be it for the video. So if you haven't already. Hit the subscribe button, join the Bayern view today and hit the subscribe button. Smash the thumbs up if you enjoyed. Let me know what you think. Would you take Eden Hazard? And until then, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out. My son, my guys. See you guys in the next one.